if you already have children and you want to have that white picket fence uh, dream and have a dog involved, really want to look at what life you have. Uh, is somebody a, a triathlon uh, athlete? Is everybody behind the desk when they get home from work? Uh, you know, we really want to look at our lifestyle. Do we want the dog just to enhance our child's life? We want to see exactly what we want so that we can look at the specific dog. And I'm not talking breed. It doesn't matter what breed you have. The ideal energy of a dog is just below yours. If you get a dog with an energy below yours, it's much easier to control. But if you're a triathlete and you get a corgi that's low energy and you get angry because it can't keep up with you on a 10 mile run, then we haven't done our due diligence. But if we get a cattle dog and we work at home behind a desk and uh, we get angry because the dog is now herding the children around and, and nipping at their heels, we haven't done our due diligence. So we want to take the time to find the right energy. Not necessarily breed. If you have a breed in mind, sure. But then look for the energy of that specific breed. Because if you do not provide an outlet for the energy that is required for that specific dog, it will find an outlet on its own. And then the human cannot complain about how he relieves it, his energy at that point. Give the dog something to do or it will find something to do. Thank you.